What's going on, everyone? This is Original Hypnotoad, welcoming you to our, our recap of our week three match in the DBL going up against my turkey subs. And uh, I'm doing a post commentary, and I'll be I'll apologize now if the audio and video is not really linked up too well because I am watching this uh, second hand. I'm not actually recording the audio with the video. I recorded the video and now I'm recording the audio so I will apologize if it's not synced up at certain times but anyways let's just go ahead and get right into it so uh, basically uh, he leads off with his uh, Landers Ferry and I lead off Gengar I go for the Hidden Power Ice here he uh, sees that I went for the Hidden Power Ice and he switches out to make it ch or not make a chance he just chance he uh, I go out into Barb our uh, Mandibus, he goes back out into Lando. I toxic the Lando, and I see that he's lifed orb. And so I switch out here. I switch out into Arco because I can get the 10 minute drop, and Rock Slide won't do too much to me. He actually takes just about as much damage as he takes from life orb as I take from Rock Slide. He goes up to Durant here. I take this chance to set up my stuff rocks. I have to switch out here though because I know he's going to take me out with anything. Uh, Superpower, I decided to let Barbara go down because Barbara kind of got its usefulness already. Uh, I go out to Tonka, my uh, choice scarfed. He ran. I go for the Lava Plume. I do get the burn, which I mean, burn on a chance he really isn't anything. I switch out to Gengar. He actually heals Heal Bell, which will get rid of his Toxic on his uh, Toxic on his which call it. I go for a Focus Blast. I hit it. He goes for Soft Boil, gets his HP back. So I switch out the Murkrow because Murkrow can taunt. Uh, he actually switches out into his uh, Delphox. So I get the parallel uh, paralysis, I go for a Dark Pulse, and I do get the flinch on the Dark Pulse, so a little parahex there, but it's whatever, I guess. Uh, I do take out the Delphox. Out comes the Landorus Farian. I go for the Feather Dance, just expecting him to go for like a Rock Slide. He actually goes for a U-Turn, which is uh, a little bit bad, I guess. Uh, he goes out into his Zelf here. I go out to Arco, the kind of bluff, the Choice Scarf. Uh, he actually goes for a Fire Blast, which I resist and eat it pretty well. I go for a knockoff, which will one shot easily. Uh, he goes back out into his Durant, and I go out into Gengar, predicting uh, superpower. Goes for the Excisor, which is fine. Uh, Focus Blast from my Gengar is going to take out the Durant, though, so no problem there. He goes back out into his uh, Landorus. I switch out here into uh, Heat Ran because I figured here there'd be no way he'd go for an Earth type move. Uh, I do outspeed with the Choice Scarf and take out the. Mon with the uh, Lava Plume. He goes up to Slow Bro. I take this chance to go to Raikou. Uh, he's going to go ahead and Mega Evolve and Calm Mind up. And even that plus one special defense of Thunderbolt almost does enough to take him out. Uh, but he's going to second set up a second Calm Mind. So a Volt Switch is going to take out the Mega Slow Bro, which just leaves Chansey left for him. And with Volt Switch, I can switch out into Arco and just go for the knockoff to knock off the Eevee Light to make Chansey even less of a threat. I think he actually just goes for the Seismic Toss here, knowing that I can't really do anything else. And Earthquake is going to take him out. So we do beat My Turkey Subs in a 4-0 victory. Uh, very good match by My Turkey Subs. Uh, one thing I will comment on is the fact that he didn't... Uh, well, that he brought kind of the same mons that he's been bringing in the past few weeks. Uh, so I kind of had an idea of what his team was going to be. Uh, he has a really good core in Mega Slowbro and Chansey. But luckily, I have a pretty good counter to that with Raikou for the Mega Slowbro and uh, Gengar because Gengar can't really get damaged by Chansey whatsoever. So, uh, kind of upset that I misplayed uh, Barb a little bit, but uh, I guess, you know, lots of things you have to have happen. Uh, basically, my two walls went down. Even though you can't really count Murkrow as a wall, it's more just a check for certain mods. Murkrow did pick up a pretty. Uh, crucial kill on the Delphox though because uh, depending on if that Delphox was scarfed or not uh, could have been a little bit interesting uh, towards the end but anyways we did pick up a solid 4-0 victory uh, I'm just trying to see uh, no every, every mon on my team actually hit the floor uh, I think every mon except for Mandibuzz actually picked up a kill as well so overall a good team effort by uh, the Omaha Omaha Stars this week and that puts us to a 2-1 overall record and uh Spoiler alert, I'll just say now. I actually know the result of uh, the other two uh, members in my division. Uh, they both actually lost this weekend, so uh, 
That puts us at a 2-1 record. Well, next up would be the Boston Weasels at a 1-2, and two, and then the uh, Denver Rapidash at 0-3. So right now we are living, li- leading the division. Uh, we also have a pretty solid differential uh, advantage as well. So uh, hopefully we can just continue going on like this. And yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and end this recording now. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.